Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So in this video, you're going to see two fights. Now this first fight is day two of map seven. And if you saw my rank up video, you will have seen that I was able to defeat Omega Red day one without too much difficulty following the strategy of hitting into his block, building up until I had 100 analysis, and then spamming the special one, special two, until he was dead. When I posted that video up, I got some advice uh, to make more contact and to spam the special one. Now, I misunderstood the advice, okay? And my alliance leader who gave me the advice didn't know that my sentinel was not awakened. So the advice he was giving me was for an awakened sentinel to bait out consecutive specials to ramp up the analysis while I could keep his health under control, that regen under control. But as you see, I wasn't able to do that. Now, I thought when he said to spam the special one that I would be able to get analysis charges faster with the special one. So I'm doing this here and I'm noticing that my analysis is not going up. And I was like, wait, that doesn't work. And you can see what time we have left. And I'm still not at 100 analysis. Okay, now I am. Now, if you watch the first day one, I was able to build up to a 100 analysis in 20 seconds. So that was working. Um, but as you can see here, once I saw how it was going, it was a little bit too late. So I'm just trying to do as much damage as possible, keep him from regening up. But I have a problem because with low health, I'm running suicides, that recoil will take me out. And once I'm very low in health, I'm not gonna be able to just come back in here unless I heal all the way back up, use a lot of items, which I try my best not to do. So I got knocked out. That was the worst way to fight Omega Red with Sentinel. So I just wanted you guys to see what that looked like. Now I did go ahead and uh, revive and heal up. And eventually I just used Corvus to get him down quickly. All right. Now this second fight is day three. Now remember, I was worried about timing out, so I did boost up as you saw there, and this time, I'm just gonna fight him the way that I know to fight him. And my alliance leader, you know, told me he was sorry, he didn't know that it wasn't uh, awakened, and that he didn't mean for me to spam the special one like I was doing to build up the analysis charges. All right, so what you see me doing here is just hitting into his block, boom. Just that fast, I've got 100, analysis this seems to work for me all right um, once I have this you know I'll fire off the special one uh, because I have maxed out despair uh, even when I fire off that special two those incinerates also reduce his healing thanks to the despair mastery I recommend everyone get that despair mastery it is so valuable Okay, so here I waited until I had a special two and I'm just firing and look how much damage that's doing. And see all this right here? He's not regening as well as he normally would because he had those incinerates. Okay, so now I'm trying to be as aggressive as possible here. You know, he's turtling up a little bit, but I hit him with the special one, keep that uh, health down. And now I'm like, okay, I need to bait out that, that special two. And all the while, you know, if I didn't have that heal block on him, he would have been regening up. So everything is going okay so far. But this is day three. And I'm like, okay, I'm watching the clock. And I'm like, I should have enough time. Those incinerates are just so devastating. They do a lot of damage and reduce his healing thanks to the despair mastery. So everything looks like it's going great. And this is how I fight him and will continue to fight him until I can get him awakened. And I might still do that anyway. All right, so it looks like we're gonna do just fine here. And here we go, down he goes. That 1% is just crazy. But that's gonna do it. Now, one drawback to this is if I don't 
attack him first with full health. If one of my alliance mates goes in first and gets him down low, that particular style won't work very well because he's going to regen almost all the way back up. So everything that my alliance mate did earlier is not going to help me. Okay? Um, so I have to be the first, and I have to get him down one shot. All right? So that's going to do it. Hopefully you learned something. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Click like, subscribe, leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day.